popcorn machine created by Charles Craters. Charles Craters' Early Life Charles Craters was the inventor of the popcorn machine. He was born in Lebanon, Warren County, Ohio, on December 11, 1852. He, di- he died in Chicago Cook County, Illinois, on June 24, 1934. Charles Craters was born into a family of chairmakers, with seven siblings and Charles being the youngest of seven. Beginning. When married, he became a successful cracker baker in Scott, Kansas. He eventually sold his company and moved to to Decatur, Illinois. After a major robbery, Charles started a candy business. This business was only the start of his success. When in this business, Charles was not fond of the poorly designed and built machine. This picture shows the roaster used during Charles's time. Also, the roaster that Charles wanted to improve. A roaster for all. The steam-powered popcorn machine was invented in 1893. This invention was made by Charles Craters alone. Popcorn was a well-known and loved snack for others. For others, the discovery of this helped many businesses and commercial advertisements grow. This also became famous because of the Depression or the, New, or the New York Stock Exchange that many were going through at the time. Charles's invention gave customers an amazing, an amazing popcorn and the best they could buy anywhere. A safer solution. The invention of the roaster first started off as a roaster for peanuts. This is what first sparked Charles's interest in a better machine for popcorn. In 1890 through 1910, Charles's, Charles created steam-powered machine that roasted more of everything, including peanuts, coffee, chestnuts, and popcorn. This idea attracted attention from the people in sales. During this time, he also created the first horse-drawn carriage, or wagon for popcorn. A variety of wagons and carriages were made by Charles Craters for the popcorn wagon. The wagon was a major step for Charles and the public. This is because this wagon was the first popcorn machine with an electric motor. He solved a small issue and many enjoyed this invention. This also gave many jobs, especially because of the popularity of the invention. The very first electric popper. 1910 through 1920 was when the biggest advancements happened with the electric popper also led by Charles. This was an an invention that solved many problems and dangers that occurred with the steam-powered machine. This was also the year of motion pictures, which created a growth with the electric popper or earn more popper, one of the most popular choices in theaters. The advancements of today in the past. Over the years, the popcorn machine evolved and changed whether whether it was that the popcorn machines held more popcorn popcorn metering devices, or changing the look or design of the popcorn machines to catch the eye. Many models were made between times, such as the Model 400, that steadily grew because it was an electric peanut roaster. This was also used through the 1920s. 1980 through through 2010 were the most advanced and recent popcorn machines, with increasing with increasing production capacity. It had many new advancements, whether it was seasoning switches, stainless steel kettles, cabinets for toppings, and many more modern day advancements. The popcorn machine, a major success. I think this invention was a major success because it helped during the Great Depression when motion pictures boomed. I also think it was a success because we still use Charles's idea today. Many of us use Crater's invention in modern, in modern form, whether it's at home when using the microwave, or when we see, or when we see it at the movies when we order our popcorn.